I'm Leo Lenbeck. I'm the chairman of Pulmatech, a private company here in Houston that's developing drugs that stimulate the innate immune system to protect you against pneumonia. Over the last 10 years, we've been developing this drug with a specific focus on cancer patients, helping them during their chemotherapy. That's part of the reason why the folks at MD Anderson, who were the inventors of this technology, started working on it. And then together with Texas A&M, Fan Innovation Studio, the biotech studio that I started, and a variety of other top flight organizations, we've been working hard to bring this drug to market. But a couple of weeks ago, we made a decision to pivot, and a lot of folks are calling us wanting to know more about that. So I'm here to talk to you about that and tell you about it, largely because our team is working full time, 18 hours a day, in order to get prepared to take this drug into an a upcoming clinical trial. The team is first-rate drug development people with decades of experience led by Dr. Colin Broom, our CEO, who himself took his company, the previous company, Nabriva Public, with an anti-infective drug that he helped shepherd through the FDA approval process. So where's Pulmatech right now? We've made a lot of progress. The key thing here is we've actually already tested this in, in human beings, two phase one clinical, clinical trials under our belt. The drug is safe and well tolerated in the, in the clinical setting. Um, we just filed two phase one, phase two protocols with the FDA, against, specifically against COVID-19. Those went in today, and we really hope to be able to start that with our clinical partner, Houston Methodist, as early as next week. We have enough drug product in hand to be able to run that trial, and so we're anxious to get started. We really want to see if we can make an impact against the COVID-19 virus. Now, we think we can largely because we've already tested this in preclinical studies against coronaviruses. And so we have data, for instance, on SARS that shows that if you take mice and you give them our drug and then you give them a, a SARS virus, they survive. If they don't get the drug, they all die. We also see a big reduction in MERS uh, viruses within that, uh, that model. But it's not a surprise to us because actually this whole approach is pathogen agnostic. It works for sort of everything we've thrown at it, from anthrax to flu to bacteria. Why is that the case? It's because of the, the innate immune system. In your lungs, the innate immune system is the frontline defense that protects you against viral and bacterial and fungal infections. It's an arms race when you get a virus that enters the lungs. Does the virus infect the lungs? and you get pneumonia or are you able to fight it off? What we do is we stimulate the existing lung lining, that epithelial layer with our drug, Pole 42, that turns on those frontline defenses and brings them to high alert. Once that happens, when the, when the virus hits the lung lining, it dies because it's exposed to what are called reactive oxygen species, which basically destroy the virus on contact. Anyway, this is just a brief overview of what we're doing, a quick status report. It's exciting days to come. We're very hopeful that we can show an effect against the COVID-19 pandemic. If you'd like more information, go to our website, pulmatech.com. And uh, please feel free to share this video with your friends and, and keep an eye out for upcoming developments. Thanks.